Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you again so much for our time together. Tonight, I'll be preaching in all of the campuses on reflecting the glory of God, coming into the presence and being changed in the presence of God and then allowing that glory to shine off of our lives. But right now, come with me to the book of 2 Peter, chapter 1, beginning with verse 12. Therefore, I intend always to remind you of these qualities, though you know them and are established in the truth that you have. I think it is right, as long as I am in this body, to stir you up by way of reminder, since I know that putting off my body will be soon, and the Lord Jesus Christ has made that clear to me. And I will make every effort so that after my departure you may be able at any time to recall these things. Now, now listen to Peter. He says, you know what? I'm going to heaven soon. I, I get to go home. I'm going to put off this body. The Lord has made this clear to me. And he said, I want to make sure that after my departure, after I lay down this body and I go to heaven, that you can remember the things that I've taught you. Now, what I want you to see today is that the Lord made clear to him that it was time to come home. The Apostle Paul says pretty much the same thing. He said, I've finished my race. There comes a point near the end of a person's life where you realize, I've done everything God wants me to do. I'm finished. I've finished my race. It is not something that we run right up until we die. We, we finish the race. There's, there's a sense of fulfillment and accomplishment, and I've done everything that God wanted me to do. But there's also a sense, and I really believe this, that God makes us aware of when it's time to come home. I've watched it in so many of my relatives. God makes us aware that soon we're coming home. And it has nothing to do with our age. It has to do with, it's time to come home. We finished. God made Peter aware of it. God made Paul aware of it. I believe God will make some of our Lolos and Lolas aware of it so that you maximize your last days, you maximize your last months to make sure that the things you want your children and your grandchildren to remember are remembered. <music>